What's going on guys, it's been GD here from Get Fixed, and today we're talking top 6. Here are 6 things that may be on the upcoming iPhone 6s. Number 6. Force Touch. This allows the phone to tell the difference between somebody tapping and pressing the phone's digitizer. If this function does indeed exist within the iPhone 6s, then you'll be able to dictate what pressing the phone screen will do. An example of Force Touch is having the ability to activate the turn-by-turn -turn navigation on the GPS simply by pressing on your desired destination. Number 5. 4K Camera. Rumors has it that the iPhone 6s will have a 12 megapixel camera, therefore will be able to record in stunning 4K resolution. The iPhones are known to have some of the best cameras even at 8 megapixels, so hey, let's see what you could do in 4K, bud. <laughs> let's go. Benji, did you just say 4K? You know what? F this sh I quit. I'ma use this phone to be the next Steven Spielberg and shoot a movie. E.T. go home? <laughs> Um, okay. That's fine with me, Chad. I was looking for a way to fire you anyways. All you do is sit in the studio and eat my chips. At this point, I don't even know why I pay you anymore. All you do is watch me, watch you, watch me. Watch you. Logic! I don't know about you, but I'm thinking about shooting a movie this summer. Who's with me? No? Okay. <laughs> Number four. Faster Touch ID. The Touch ID fingerprint scanner will be 30% faster. This change may be done as a way to improve Apple Pay. Number 3. Shorter battery life. This is something that should be expected considering all these major updates that are being done to this phone. The greater the updates, the more sacrifices that gotta be made. Number 2. No more Ben Gate. If you're familiar with Ben Gate, then you know that there were a few instances where people experienced the iPhone 6 bending near the volume rocker when placed in their back pocket. Who puts a phone in? Whatever. This housing is made of a more durable, strong material. It is thickened where the bending occurred. Last but not least, number one. 2 gigabytes of RAM from the new A9 chip. That's right, it's an update from the 1 gigabyte of RAM 64-bit A8 chip we previously had on the iPhone 6. Somebody got mad last week when I said the Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge Plus has faster processing speeds due to the upgrade of RAM, calling me an idiot and informing me that he has 4 gigabytes of RAM, which is something I was already aware of. You do realize that upgrading RAM means the phone process is faster, right? <laughs> okay, whatever, but I'll accept the fact that I'm the idiot. Be sure to check out my other videos on the China where I do reviews and repair devices like phones, tablets, and so on. What good is <laughs> what good is a screen repair without the proper tools to do it? Click here if you would like to purchase this professional repair kit from Amazon. If you're interested in checking out a channel that's all about repairing, be sure to check out my boy Jerry Rig Everything by clicking here. Let them know I sent you. Why not, right? Anyways, guys, been GD here from Get Fixed and ah, <laughs> I'm out. Peace. Catch you in the next one.